Hello guys, today we are going to learn the full screen API in JavaScript. Actually, this API allows any single element to be viewed in full screen. Unlike pressing F11 uh, key to force your browser to full screen, this API is intended for images, videos and games running within a container. So when you enter a full screen mode, a message informs the user they can, they can, they can press escape at any time to return to the page. The full screen API is now supported uh, by all the recent desktop browsers including IE11 also. Let me create a new directory here and let me move this image here and let me create a new HTML document and let me save it inside my 18th directory and my HTML snippet Yeah, everything is done. In this video lesson, we are going to learn how to view the full HTML page in full screen and some particular element alone in full screen. Okay, let me add a heading tag here full screen, not a publication, like full screen API in JS. Okay, and let me add an image here. And sources mac dot png. Sorry, this is png. And button on click. This is view page. And let me add a text here. View page in full screen. Okay, let me copy this and paste it here view image in full screen okay this should be view image that's all about page design let's add the javascript code okay let me add a new function here toggle full screen all command is element actually uh, this method is intended to view the element in full screen which is passed from the parameter. Okay, we need to exit from the full screen if any element is already full screened. To find the element which is full screened, we can use this attribute full screen element. So this will be true uh, if this is true, meaning that the current page is in full screen, but we need to uh, add some browser specific checks here okay let me copy this and or and i paste it here i paste it here and i paste it here let me add browser specific changes first mozilla full screen this should be capital and where is that okay this is for webkit based browsers like Chrome, Opera and this is for Microsoft browsers like IE and Edge so those browsers need this check okay so if this is true we need to exit from the full screen okay so if document sorry if document dot exit full screen if this is true we need to exit again it needs browser specific checks okay so let me copy this code and add else here and paste it here else paste else paste yeah okay let me add a check here first mozilla actually here this is not exit full screen actually in mozilla it's a mozilla cancel full 
full screen. Let's add the same here and for WebKit, actually WebKit, this is actually WebKit exit full screen. This should be capital. Yes. Let me copy this and paste it here. And finally, MS based browsers, MS exit full screen. Let me copy this and paste it here. Now our else part. Now, <coughs> now this part is about requesting the full screen. This is also very easy to implement. Let's add a check. If document dot document element can request full screen. I'm sorry. So if this is true means the element which is passed in the parameter can be full screened. Okay. So el dot request full screen. Yeah. Let me copy this code here and paste else paste it here. Else paste else and paste. Okay. Let's let's add a check for uh, Mozilla based browsers. Instead of request full screen, we need to do MOZ request full screen. Okay, for Mozilla based browsers, we need to make this yes capital and here we have kit request full screen and finally this should be ms request full screen and do the same here yeah i am done with this now let's uh, implement the view page and the view image method quickly okay function view page no argument or body will be where l equal to for this my element will be old body uh, let's fix this l oh, okay and i pass this value to the toggle full screen method and let me copy this method and paste it here and this should be view image and this should be get element by id my image yes i should be capital okay let's test it quickly okay this is our page which is designed now I'm um, uh, why this is like this okay let me add a break here now I'm hitting the view page in full screen button <laughs> nothing is happening let's fix this okay we misspelled the document in uh, Oh, you are so slow. Oh, 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 I'm sorry for that. Yes, we misspelled it. Document, and this is document. Let's test it. Yes, I'm hitting the full screen now, button now. Okay. Now the old page is in full screen. I'm hitting the same button again to exit. Okay. Now I'm hitting the view page, sorry, view image in full screen button. Yes. The, Im uh, the image alone is in full screen now. Now I cannot see the view image button here. So always design app in such a way you are 
button is inside your container anyway my browser supports escape key to exit okay the html5 full screen api is relatively simple but browser differences result in this kind of ugly code keep this nice api in mind for your future proje projects it may come in handy thanks for watching this video you can download the source file from the description right below this video thanks for watching this video lesson please do subscribe to get more videos like this thanks once again bye bye